Hey, uh, welcome to another tutorial from our WordPress Page Builders Academy. Uh, we have an extensive library of tutorials for uh, all the top WordPress page builders. So be sure to subscribe and hit that bell so you, you can see them when they come out. Okay, now on to today's tutorial. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a mobile first mega menu in Beaver Builder. We'll cover some best practices for making your mega menu user friendly, accessible, and effective on mobile devices. Before we get started, let's share some best practices to ensure your mega menu is optimized for mobile users. Creating a mobile first mega menu involves careful planning and design. Here are some best practices to keep in mind. Simplify navigation. Limit the number of top level items and sub menus to avoid overwhelming users. Use clear, concise labeling for easy understanding. Responsive design. Ensure the menu adapts seamlessly to different screen sizes using media queries. Touch-friendly UI. Make sure all elements are easy to tap with sufficiently large touch targets and proper spacing between items. Clear indicators for submenus. Use visual indicators like arrows or plus signs to show expandable items. Easy to open and close. Include a clear and accessible button, like a hamburger icon, for opening and closing the menu. Also, provide an intuitive way to close the menu, like swiping or tapping a close icon. Use accordion or full-screen overlay. For mobile, using an accordion style or a full-screen overlay can be effective in making the best use of limited space. Prioritize speed and performance. Optimize images and assets to reduce load times and ensure smooth performance. Use big font. Ensure that the menu is accessible to all users, including those who use screen readers or have limited eyesight. Use proper area attributes and roles for navigation elements. Ensure that all functionality is available via keyboard navigation. Let's get started. First, let's open Beaver Builder and navigate to the page where we want to edit our mega menu. The first step is to simplify our navigation. Mobile screens have limited space, so it's important to limit the number of top level items and sub menus. Here, we're going to hide the icons and only the most essential items will be visible in our top level navigation. Click on the column of the icons. Choose the breakpoints where the icons will be visible. These icons will be visible only on the desktop, and then click Save. Next, let's adjust the column width of the menu and the logo to be aligned. Hey, we've got a quick favor to ask. If you've made it this far into my tutorial, please smash the like button. It will really help out this channel and these tutorials. Okay, now back to the actual tutorial. Thank you. Let's go to the Customize section under Appearance and click Menus to add submenu items. Additionally, it's possible to add an image link with plugins like Beaver Themer, but in today's video, I will demonstrate how to create a simple mega menu without using any plugin. After adding, go back to Appearance and add a CSS class to each menu item that has submenu items. Then click the Save button. Now let's check the mega menu on mobile in Beaver Builder. And there you have it, a mobile first mega menu in Beaver Builder. Remember to simplify your navigation, ensure it's responsive, and make it touch friendly. Okay, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Uh, if you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And uh, these videos take a lot of time, so if you do appreciate the content, uh, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell so we can reach more people. Uh, thank you. And if you have any comments or questions, leave in the section below and we will get to them as soon as we can. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye.